Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So Blue Mage has received 23 brand new spells with patch 5.45 and in this video, let's go over how you're gonna get all of them. I'm not gonna go into too much excessive detail because this is meant as more of a primer and a quick up and start guide. And as always, if this content helps you in any way, I would super appreciate if you lobbed a flying sardine at that like button and cat daddy that subscribe button. So spell 81 is going to be Triple Trident, and you're going to be getting this from the Ibizu Catfish in Yangsha. Its coordinates are at X of 28 and Y of 6. At the same Ibizu Catfish, you're going to get the ability Tingle, which is spell number 82. Spell number 83 is from the Kugane Castle's second boss, which is the Dojun Maru, which gives you the ability to Tatami Gaishi. Spell number 84 is Cold Fog, and you're going to be getting this from Mist Dragon, which is the final boss of the Burn Dungeon. Spell number 85 is Stot Ram, which is from Lakshimi from Emanation. I should note, though, because I do get this question a lot in some of my other videos, is is this the extreme version? No. This is the normal version that you can get Stot Ram from. And spell number 86 is going to be Saintly Beam from the Phantom Train, which is going to be Sigma Escape 1.0, the first raid. And again, just to be clear, this is obtainable from the normal version. You do not need to go into Sigma Escape Savage for this. Spell number 87 is Feculent Flood from the Takapichi, which is from Saint Mosian's Arboratorium Hard, which is going to be the final boss. Now, spell number 88 is going to be Angel Snack, and that is going to be from the achievement of a level 70 blue mage. Spell number 89 is Chelnoan Gate, which is from the final boss of Hell's Lid Dungeon called Genbu. Spell number 90 is Rose of Destruction, which is from Ivan Curlfist, from the Temple of the Fist finals boss. Spell number 91 is Base Instinct, that you're going to be getting from Upper Lenose Cha Cha from Master Curl. Spell number 92 is Ultra Vibration, which you're going to be getting from the peaks from the Konga Moto. Specifically from X coordinate 11 to Y coordinate 25 is where you can expect to find this. Spell number 93 is going to be called Blaze, and you're going to be getting this from Delta Escape 1.0 from Ale Rote. And that is going to be, again, just to be clear, from Normal, not Savage. Don't worry about Savage from any of this. Spell number 94 is Mustard Bomb, which you're going to be learning from Omega in Alphascape version 3.0. Again, normal, don't worry about the savage. I know that I'm saying that a lot, but I just I just want, don't want people to be so worried. Spell number 95 is Dragon Force, giving me Guitar Hero Realness, where you're going to be getting that just from the achievement of learning a hundred different Blue Mage spells. Spell number 96 is Ethereal Spark, which you're going to be learning from Salt Druva from the Locks, specifically around X coordinate of 22 and Y coordinate of 22. Spell number 97 is going to be Hydropole, which is from the Kelpie that you're going to be encountering as the first boss of the dungeon Drowned City of Scala. Spell number 98 is Malediction of Water that you're going to be learning from Sai Tsui, which is the Basically, it's not the second boss, but just before the second boss in the dungeon Swallow's Compass is where you're going to encounter this. And spell number 99 is Choco Meteor. I'm terrified that this even exists, but let's keep going. And you learn this from the Corsair Chocobo from the Devranian Forelands. And there's two rough locations, which I'm going to go with the one at X of 34 and Y coordinate of 28. The hundredth spell is Matra Magic, which you're going to be learning from an achievement of a hundred spells. Spell number 101 is Peripheral Synthesis, which is going to be from Omega, the hands specifically in normal version of Alphascape version 3.0. Spell number 102 is Both Ends, that you're learning from Koitan Dashiang, which is the final boss of Swallow's Compass. Spell number 103 is going to be Phantom Flurry, which you're going to be learning from Suzaku in Hell's Ketir. And then spell number 104 is going to be Night Bloom, that you're going to be learning from Tsukiyomi from Castrum Fulminus. So honestly, with all that said, I hope that you are going to be having a ton of fun with the Blue Mage. I know that I'm really hyped to get all these spells. And anyhow, I was trying to make this video short, so I'm going to cut it there. Happy time on Blue Mage!